I love this car from Finley Kia. I love the power of this Kia. I love the styling of this Kia. I love the interior of this Kia. I love all the space in this Kia. I love. I think you love this car more than me. Don't be ridiculous, honey. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. Scheduled for three three-minute rounds, all for the Tough Enough Super Heavyweight Championship. Fight fans, it's about to go down. Introducing first in the blue corner, with two wins and no loss, fighting out of Stomp MMA, Latina, Minnesota, the challenger, Jeremy Only. Standing across the cage in the red corner, undefeated with five wins, fighting out of ATF MMA, Las Vegas, Nevada, he is the defender, Charles Williams. <laughs> Referee in charge of the action is Mark Smith. All right, gentlemen, super heavyweight title. Got your instructions, Bill. Protect yourself at all times. Obey my commands. Touch gloves now at the bell. Be ready to fight. So Umland, the challenger in black and yellow. Williams, the champion in black and gray. Both possess knockout power. Let's see what happens. Jeremy Umland already loading up on the right hand. The fight hasn't even started yet. Here it comes. <laughs> comes out swinging. Umlin, super aggressive right away. Big Ooh, right hand counter gets knockout. the cage. Or drops him. Williams on top. there. Big left hand. And that's going to do it. Huge right hand counter. Drops Umlin. Able to finish him off. Incredible victory. Mark Smith came in to stop the fight. Umlin not happy with the decision, but he was getting mauled by Charles Williams, who, as you said, defended the early bull rush, landed a counter shot, and just wailed with hammer fists. And the way you describe that as a early on as a bull rush, I really think there's no other way really to say that. He came out, he had the right hand loaded before he, the fight even started. He came out rushing him, put the pressure on, and put the heat on, and Williams landed an incredible, staggering counter right hand. You can see Williams celebrating, obviously, a happy man. Williams says that he eventually wants to perhaps even be a light heavyweight at some point in his career. He's got a long way to go to get down to there, but he's having a lot of fun at super heavyweight. In the meantime, you see the sportsmanship here. We said it going in. In the super heavyweight division, anything can happen. And this is what we saw here. The right hand counters coming off the left as well. But it was the big right that put Umland on the floor. And then in came the hammer fist. Mark Smith, you can see, was right there. He was calling for some kind of defense, some kind of answer for Umland, who didn't think he was hurt bad enough to lose the fight, but just wasn't responding. So Charles Williams keeps his belt. Let's take it up the cage to get the official time. Ladies and gentlemen. Hold on, this is gonna be good. After 10 seconds into the first round, your winner by knockout, Charles Williams, and still tough enough, super heavyweight champion. Charles Williams keeps the belt in 10 seconds. I am here with the defending super heavyweight tough enough champion. Ten second victory here tonight. What took you so long? <laughs> I mean, uh, I had the opportunity. First of all, let me thank God. Let me thank my mom, Heather Tristan, my dad. Uh, let me thank uh, Playboy Energy Drink. Let me take ATF Angelo for the wrestling. Thank you, thank you for coming. I appreciate it very much. And the fans, y'all are awesome. We, we want to do this again in Mesquite. But I had the opportunity to talk to Mr. Umlin for three hours. I mean, we made a great friendship. So there's no hard feelings here. I saw a lot of mutual respect between both of you at the weigh-ins. He came out rushing you early, early onslaught. You had to withstand that early rush. You landed a huge counter right hand. Walk us through how you finished the fight. Well, 
I had a feeling because the ref had told me that he said he didn't want to touch gloves in the beginning. So I had a feeling he was going to come out and try to hit me hard. So I just stepped back so then he had to come closer again and meet the hook. And then from there, I just kept throwing punches. When he hit the ground, I just wanted to keep throwing punches over and over and over again. Every time we see you at Tough Enough, we see an impressive knockout. Are we going to be able to see you again soon? Yes, yes. Um, I was 350 pounds last time. I'm 328 pounds this time. I should be about 300 pounds, 290. And uh, we're going down. Ladies and gentlemen, let's hear a big hand for the Tough Enough defending super heavyweight champion, 10 second knockout, 10 second TKO victory, Charles Williams. So Charles Chucky Williams, your defending super heavyweight champion. Impressive work yet again. We're still the early garage for Jeremy Omelette and defended his belt. Another great night of fights here at the Casablanca Resort and Casino in Mesquite, Nevada. Tough enough, the future stars of mixed martial arts.